Um, last minute winner. <laughs> You're buzzing, Fellaini. <laughs> good performance, good three points. We was, uh, we was three minutes away from going through a whole Champions League group phase of not scoring a goal at home in any of the games. But they, I, I can only just take what, one positive out of that, and that's the fact that I don't have to come back here on a Thursday night. Because <laughs> that would have killed me this year, that. Yeah. But no, it's the win's a win, isn't it? I mean, the game was crap. We were pretty crap, to be honest. Was again. there any difference with that and the Palace game? No. It wasn't, was there? To be honest, I can't remember their keeper having a significant save. No. To be honest, the, the what? See, the energy levels were up a little bit more in the first half, a little bit, mainly through Fred in the middle. But again, I went on last, uh, went on a weekend about the team selection at the start and the fact that Matic and Fellaini are still in that midfield. And he might, there was there was there was no plan there. It didn't seem like there was a plan there. Again, again, it was like a long ball up to Fellaini and he pulled us out the crap again at the end. But there was a moment in that second half there where Phil Jones was running down the right wing, laid it off to Fellaini, who crossed it in for Lukaku. <laughs> Where's the system? Have what we got trouble that? when Fellaini, when Valencia comes off and and Phil Jones is a better right back than Valencia? Is that, does that show like oh, Valencia's <laughs> done? We know Valencia's <laughs> done, mate. I mean, it, it it will be criminal if that guy gets a contract. I, mm. Thank you for the service. Yeah. Yeah, he wasn't always bad, but yeah. I mean, everyone gets old, and you're old, mate. It's time to go. It's, he's done in there. He's, he's not got it anymore. Fan before you said that Jose is going to use that to say. Look, Fellaini, last minute, good spirit. Do, 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 you, do you buy that if, if he comes out with that? Would you buy that? No, there's no way. There's not this, if he comes out with that, it's, he's going to come out with that excuse. We're not going to kid ourselves, are we? But yeah, Dave, Fellaini's actually, Fellaini's actually a better striker than Lukaku at the moment, isn't he, to be honest? Because, yeah. I mean, at the end of the day, we, I was praying that one of them went in for Rashford today. Because yeah. Emerino wouldn't have had the excuse to drop him. He's going to drop him on Saturday against Southampton, and Lukaku's going to play again. I'm he was non literally non existent when he came on. He doesn't do anything, no. He just sit, he just just makes a sprint. He's knackered and he just saunders up to the halfway line. He's not even he's not even looking for all he does is point his finger here and there, trying to tell other people that they're doing things wrong. But he's miles behind the rest of the team. And the rest of the team's not that good, to be mm. honest, is it? I mean it's just Pogba came on, just looked frustrated straight away. He's come on, he's like, he's, at, he's actually was like, what am I playing with here straight away? There was no one moving. We had four players in a line on the 18 yard box, 18 yard box, not moving at all. And it's just, he's, there's, there's no. Plan. Do you think, do you think the writing's still on the wall? Then you still, we have, not like we turned the corner. You think we haven't made any progress, obviously, you know I mean? since young the last boy, game. It's, it's still on the cards from Mourinho in terms of this pressure. Young boys are shite, mate, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> Young boys are shite, aren't they? Let's yeah. be honest, mate. We had to beat them today. We scraped past them. Mm. So, I mean, Southampton at the weekend, it's going to be the same game again, isn't it? Yeah. And they're a relegation Desperate. dogfight as well. Desperate, aren't they? And it's just going to be one of them. We'll scrape past them. We're playing away from Old Trafford help us, do you reckon? Yeah, it will do. But how much at the end of the day? I mean, we may scrape a result against them again, but what's next then? Arsenal at Old Trafford. It's looking like a bit of a nightmare that at the moment, isn't it? It's not, it's not an easy game. And no one's an easy game at Old Trafford at the moment. There's nothing yeah. there, is there? The atmosphere wasn't there tonight. Well, it was from them. Yeah. They made a, they made a night of it, but it was their night out tonight. You could see it was them. That's how poor they are. They just came for one night out at Old Trafford, and we couldn't get past them, mate. It's, yeah, we won the game, but it was sheer luck. Injury it, time it? scraped it with Fellaini. Oh God, we're clutching at straws, aren't we? Let's be honest, but. You know what? Wins a win at the end of the day. We're not in the Europa League. That is the main positive out of this tonight, that we don't have to keep coming back on a, fr on a Thursday night as well. But, but it is, like I said, it is, it's just another poor performance. And is it going to get better? It doesn't look like there's a plan going forward. And that's my worry. Because he, he, he hasn't got a set team. He hasn't got one player for a certain position in any position on the pitch. That mix and match and just have a go in it every game, every game. Where was Fellaini playing today? Well, it, looked, it looked to me like it was the furthest forward at times, like it was like a like a ten, and then offside loads of times. Then he was the deepest. It was just all over the place, wasn't it? But it's, it's like they don't know where they're playing on the pitch. That's what it is. I mean, De Gea knows where he's playing. That's, that's about it. No one else really knows. Right, we're going Southampton. We're going to win that game. Uh, well, we might scrape it, we might scrape it, and then it's Arsenal in it after that, and that's, I'm not looking at Southampton, I'm looking at the Arsenal game really thinking that's what I want to be judging us against, but I'm still worried about Southampton to be honest, but we've just got to, what can we do, just match day comes, get behind the boys on the match day, and then, well it is what it is. Isn't it? Nice one, Adam. Yeah. Cheers, man.